Welcome to Keto Life Support, where we make your keto life sustainable, fun, and low stress. I'm Kim Howerton, and I'll be coming to you weekly with some of my keto besties to bring you the practical, real-world keto advice that you need. Quick disclaimer, I am not a doctor, and even if we do have a doctor in the house from time to time, he or she is not your doctor, and nothing we say on this show should be taken as medical advice. Always check in with a trusted medical professional about your own personal medical concerns. Hello and welcome to Keto Life Support. This is Kim Howerton with episode 183. And today, I'm going to give you a little taste of Keto Palooza. So I just got back from Keto Palooza in Louisville, Kentucky. That's put on by Autumn. She is awesome. You can find her at Watch Autumn Keto on the YouTubes and the socials. It's an annual event. I think this is the fourth one. It's the first one I've gone to, but man, let me say that it was super duper. So what did I experience? Well, first, there were a lot of amazing speakers. Some of the usual suspects. Ken Berry was there. I was there, of course, or else this would be a weird podcast to do. Um, We had Maria Emmerich, we had Two Crazy Ketos, we had Tony Hampton, we had Annette Bosworth, and if I'm forgetting anybody, I feel really bad about that, but my brain is a little short-circuity today. I'm recording this anyway because I have some enthusiasm. It was a wonderful, it was a one-day, well, it was a one-day speaker event, but there was like an evening thing the night before, and there was a celebration brunch the next day. And I think more than anything, what I want to say about this event was it was like a social support network. Everyone was so excited to be there. I could tell a lot of people had been there before, but new people were super welcomed. Autumn does an amazing job. She put like lots of social events, like at the front end and the back end to really give you that solid connected experience. And so if you're somebody looking for community in the keto community, to use the word twice, if you're looking for connections in the keto community, let me say it that way, I think this is maybe the best event to do it at. It was warm, it was connected, I felt so welcomed, and I just felt like everyone had open arms. And the other thing that I want to mention is... I like it. I think it's good, but you can make your own opinion. Autumn worked harder, I think, than anyone I've ever seen on it getting together like good swag. Good stuff that got donated from companies. So like the swag bag was awesome. And there was a giveaway at the brunch, which was full of good stuff. I've gone to a lot of events where you get what they're calling a swag bag. And it's like some coupons and one or two items, right? It's not... Not super exciting. And this event had lots of swag. And I just want to call Autumn out because this is no small task. When you reach out about stuff for people, the little gifties, a lot of companies might not get back to you. So I can tell like how much effort she put into this thing. And this conference was super well organized. Things were great. And the swag bag was awesome. So I just, it's almost like a sign, you know, like it's like when your hotel room is super clean and everyone's really friendly, you're like, this is a great hotel. Like the swag bag, I was like, this is a quality event, right? Just tell. And the speakers all shared really great stuff. The event was not recorded. So I think if you are interested in hearing what people have to say about this event, experience this event, it's really an in-person thing. You know, I find conferences fall into two categories. One is about the community and one is about like the science. The speakers were all great, but this event is much more about the community and sharing helpful tips, like people doing the thing on the ground, boots on the ground, right? Whereas like some other conferences like Metabolic Health Summit, those are about a lot of science being jammed into your head so that you can then take that knowledge forward. So, you know, if you're a person out there being like, I want to start going to conferences, but I'm more interested in like how it applies to me and changing my life. Well, I think you can't go wrong booking if she has it next year. I don't know that it's up yet or if it's planned, but if it is, Keto Palooza, I think, is on the top of the list of events to go to. Now, the people that do Keto Chow, the Bears, their event was very much 
this community connected event, but they've changed to a monthly meetup. So they're spreading their event out over the year instead of having one annual event. And so, you know, if you're near Salt Lake, their event is great when they have a speaker go and see that they do a monthly thing. But if we're looking for like an annual thingamajig, I'm going to vote for Keto Palooza right now as the options are out there. Now, after I record this, some new conferences may come up and I'd be like, oh, that one too. But of the things I've gone to this year, I got the most warm fuzzies and I saw the most connection happening. You know, it was like a family reunion experience at Keto Palooza. If nobody gets it, L-O-U, Lusa, like not that you're a Lusa, like Louisville, which I don't think I'm saying quite right. You really have to drag the tongue on the end of that. It's like Louisville. I can't. I'm a Californian. I can't say it quite right. But, you know, there you go. And that was my experience. And I just wanted to share it and give a big shout out to Autumn of Watch Autumn Keto. She is fantastic. And her husband is hilarious. And so they're like the power couple. And I hope that everyone found this helpful. It's just a little burst of enjoyment experience. And I will be back with you next week to share something else. You know, whatever comes up. All right, guys, talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for joining us for this episode of Keto Life Support. Want more information? Want show notes? Want to suggest a topic? Just head over to ketolifesupport.com. That's where all that kind of thing can go on. By the way, I have a request. If you could go to your podcast host and hit subscribe, we would really, really appreciate it. And what would be even more awesome is if you could write a review. And what would be even more awesome than that is if you could write like a really flattering review. Just asking, you know, you do you. All right. So thanks so much for joining us. I'm thrilled that you're part of the Keto fam. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.